folks, and welcome back to another Let's Play. I'm Black Temper, and welcome to Blood Bowl 2, The Campaign. Now, as many of you know, I'm doing Neon League matches, so if you want to watch that, go to my playlist and you'll see them. But in this segment, we're going to be doing The Campaign. Now, I'm going to be honest, I've had a little go with The Campaign, and if you're thinking of learning through The Campaign, you can do that, it's a good learning curve, but it does, you know, it doesn't reflect the game very well on that but it is a good campaign now normally i would shut these two up jim and bob but unfortunately we need them because they are going to tell the story of what's going on with the reichlin reavers that's who we're going to be now as you can see guys yes i've had a go at it to see what it's like so we're going to start a new campaign actually i'm going to delete this because since we're all going to be traveling together we're going to go through a campaign now like I said, it doesn't reflect the actual game itself, but it is a story, so let's get on with it. Good evening to all you Cabal Vision viewers out there in the old world and beyond. I hope your crystal ball is fully charged. And if not, find yourselves a wizard and chain him to it. Because the 2513 season promises to be one hell of a show, doesn't it, Bob? It sure does. Oh, and Iron Jim. Iron what, Bob? Your shirt? Chains, Jim. Iron chains for chaining up your wizard. Iron is best. It's harder to enchant than steel or silver. Oh, <laughs> and don't forget to break their fingers as well. I, I, thank you, thank you, Bob. Yes, fascinating. And we may come back to that later. In the meantime, all you sports fans should keep it here on brand new Cabal Vision HD. But what about all you new viewers who are joining us for the first time? How would you explain a game of Blood Bowl to someone who hasn't experienced the joy and delight of it before, Bob? Firstly, I'd say, under what toilet in the realm of chaos have you been hiding? Then I'd begrudgingly explain that Blood Bowl is a visceral, violent sport where two teams of players must get an inflated pig bladder or ball across a large field into the opponent's end zone by any means necessary to score a touchdown. The catch, there's only one ball. And the opposing team is trying to do exactly the same thing. A match lasts for two halves of eight turns. The team with the most touchdowns wins. Very nicely summed up, Bob. So, what about the teams? It promises to be an interesting season, especially for the Reichland Reavers. Let's remind ourselves by taking a quick look what happened in their final game last year. That's the team we're going to be. And tell you something, you know, Bob, he puts the game so eloquently. <laughs> well, he's not wrong, though. He's half right, but he does put it in eloquent terms. If you call it that. So, yeah, we're going to be um, playing as the Reichland Reavers. And we're going to go the quest from being nobodies to somebodies. Or should I say, has to heroes. I wish this would hurry up so we can um, get on with the show. This is the final game of the last season. The Reavers versus the Gouge die. Just look at those human lumps. Why aren't they moving? A frozen spell. Could they not just let it all go? Look at player 16. Josh <laughs> He just stands there and lets that block fork smack him right in the kisser. They don't seem to be scratchy in that trolley. Die, do they? Do they? No. no wonder this team has won it. There's only so many double skulls rolling in the table. The fans are claiming that's a load of steaming bull. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that was the Reavers' last public appearance, summing up ten seasons of decline. Why have they yeah. been fired yet, Jim? That's what I can't understand. The word is, Bob, that J.J. Griswell Jr. hasn't got the cash to replace them. <laughs> yeah? Oh, Griswell was once said to be even richer than you, Jim. He's now down to his last few pennies after paying the likes of Griff Oberwald his massive wage for several decades. I guess he'll just have to put up with using last season's dregs. Anyway, enough yapping. Let's see how they do in this preseason match. Alright, got my first match, guys. I'm facing the Saints. So yeah, basically we're going to take the right Reavers from being losers to winners. 
And I do like the um, the frozen pun. That was pretty um, classy. Well, let's see how the Reavers get on. It's their first match under the leadership of the new coach in a preseason friendly. Never use the word friendly in connection with Blood Bowl, Jim. You'll end up getting sued for false advertising. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. <laughs> You're not wrong there, Bob. You would be sued for, for false advertising. Because he's right, Blood Bowl isn't friendly. As many of you will know from my matches, you got to be bloody ruthless. But yeah, I do like the fact this game throws a little pun or two. And also, I like the fact as well, they give you like references in Blood Bowl on how certain things go about. You know, like the Troll Sayers. So it does give you a little bit of, you know, Blood Bowl lore. And good for, for several decades? How old do these guys live for in the um, old world? Centuries? Because last time I checked, he's human, not an elf. Unless he's a corpse that's been reanimated and we don't know about it. But in any case, this is our first Welcome match against the Saints. Sorry, Sigma Hammers. But the Springfield Saints at the stadium. But it's the Saints. That's my team. There's that evil little bugger. They get the Jews. Are a good team. They can pass, catch, hit, and run with the ball. Here we go. See what game they bring today. Now, yeah, there's a. This is like a little tutorial match, guys. Most of this game will be tutorials. In the and oh yeah, the reason there's no dice is because that's the whole point. The first part of this tutorial is about playing the basic game. And what about that incident that forced him to leave in the first place? What? That tabloid sting in 04? Involving a pair of halflings, jam, and a four hour immigrant? Oh, what's he talking about? Proven, even in retirement, Helmets continued to be a loyal ally of the Reavers. Well, he's certainly experienced, Bob. The new head coach should listen to his advice. Yeah. That's talking about the guy who's popping up. Now, I'm going to be honest, guys. The first lot, it's it's going to be boring because it's all about, you know, learning the game. Before we get to the actual good stuff. So go to there. Yes, they picked up the ball. Whoopie dee doo. I'm going to catch it there. So yeah guys, you don't need to do much in this part of the game, it's just pretty much a training game, just to get it all out the way and hopefully to the good stuff. But, as many games do, they gotta have a train level too, and I slip. And the turn there. So yeah, there's our objectives, score the match, score the first touchdown. And the AI will try and stop you, they are a little more clever. Alright. How far can he go? Yep, he can do it. Time the blitz. <laughs> nice. Now, normally, they would not get away with that. Oh, come on. How the hell can you not dodge? Now, in normal, in a normal game, that would have been the end of my turn. But because this is a training game, I can get away with a lot of this. So, it's basically telling us, you know, how to play the game and all that. So if you not play the game, it is a good tool to learn a bit of the game. But I wouldn't, you know, reference it as the proper game because 
of the fact that you know when I fell over that dodge the game my turn should be over right there and then Fight. Right, moving forward. Don't forget to pick up your Jesus, is it? <laughs> and he rolls over. I can't see Reaver Star Player and Captain Griff Overwald on the field, Jim. And where's the mighty Zog? Why is he not <laughs> running Diamond Head Overshot? Huh? I thought the violence Skoda was severely tired. Why are they not here? Now? Haven't you heard? Ever since his men's fragrance, Gruff by Griff, flopped, he hasn't been seen all off-season. Rumor has it his investors are not happy and want their money back. I tried some of that scent. What was he thinking? I'm an ogre, and even I couldn't stand the smell. I'd rather take a drag from a goblin's crotch than that. <laughs> Zug, why isn't he? Nice. Zug's so disgusted with the Reaver's performance of but if a Reichland legend like Helmut Zwimmer is back, well, you never know. I don't like it, Joe. The whole point is that the Reavers Get out. The glorious devastation and maiming left in Zug's way. I love a good maiming me. <laughs> that last burst of speed. Always risky. What a speed star. Get up. Get up. I guess them give it to him. Right, that gets rid of him. Block him up so he can't go anywhere. Move right next to a teammate. So yeah, as soon as one of my guys scores, the, this game ends. I'm being honest, I'm not, you know, spoiling anything. Like I said, this match is pretty much for training purposes. Jesus Christ. Put some pressure on the ball carrier. Move quicker. Okay, let's give it to some people. Oh, what's next to yoga? Let's get this over with. <laughs> nice. I do like the animation, guys, when you know when they smack someone. It is kind of cool. I mean, I'm probably going to take it off on my... in. You know, um, online matches, but I'll probably keep it on for this. Right, pass the ball. They to pass you. the ball, but yeah. will it be a completion? I smell a quick touchdown here. And that is it. Ah! Touchdown. Yeah, we hoping. Game. Looks like the Saints are chicken out. We just win by the fall. That's the only game we win all season. I would be surprised. Yep, that's it. That was quick, short, and sweet. So yeah, that was just a you know basic purpose of um, you know moving around and all that. So let's continue with the story. Well, would you look at that? The Reavers won. Yeah, but the Saints whipped out early. Hold on. I have shocking news. JJ has fired the whole Reaver squad. Not oh, that crap. shocking, Jim. Griswold's having a clear out before the 25-13 season gets underway. One default win against no hopers like the Saints ain't gonna cut it. 
He should have done it sooner. So if the whole squad's been sacked, where's this new coach going to find his team, Bob? JJ's a cunning old devil, Jim. My contacts say he can get a whole squad of fresh-faced wannabe new players from the rejects found on that reality Cabal Vision show, Reichland Ain't Got Talent. <laughs> Sounds like a risky strategy to me, Bob. Risky, Jim? I've seen snotlings come up with more competent plans. <laughs> That's very nice, but I do like that Britain's Got Talent joke. Right, so now we get to make our team. Yep. So let's open up. Yep, so my first player choice is going to be an ogre. Normally I wouldn't pick an ogre as a first choice, but for campaign purposes I will pick him. Four blitzers, because they're good. One thrower. Couple of linemen. Actually, a couple of them um, catches. Confirm purchase. How's this new coach doing so far, Bob? Well, he managed to put some names in the roster so far, Jim. And now we need to get a sponsor. For the chaos cup just yet. <laughs> so we're gonna Don't get some get bell coach. polishes. You need to maintain your deals done, contract signed. The Reichland Reavers have a sponsor. I only hope they read the small print, Bob. Yeah. I remember I once signed a contract to get eternal life. It sounded so simple. But the whole craving blood, dread vampire curse thing, well, that wasn't in 12 point Helvetica, I can tell you. <laughs> yeah, Jim, but um, you are a vampire. But anyway, let's get on with this game, and this is the next match against the Death Heads. Ah, welcome back, sports fans. And who'd have thought we'd be covering this game, Bob? I'm as excited as a snotling in a pump wagon, Jim. <laughs> the rumors are true. The Reavers have finally got a sponsor. Well, subject to contract negotiations. That's true, Bob. It's not set in stone yet. But the newly reformed NAF are certainly putting pressure on them to get funding. Gone are the days when any Targ, Dita, or Harbinger can turn up with a team of nobodies. With Cabal Vision HD comes money. So you need the gold to get in. Even a franchise with as much history as Reichland. So, who have they got? An outfit called Parstown X3. Never heard of them. They manufacture bell polishing cream. They're not big corporate players, Jim. That's a sponsor the Reavers wouldn't even have considered in their heyday. But beggars can't be choosers. So yeah, unfortunately for the Reichlands, they would never consider these guys. But because of the fact they're in such a bad state, and the rules of the new league states we need a sponsor to fund our way into the new league, we're going to be um, taking them in. Now the second match is still a tutorial match, but however, it will be more fit into the game, except for the fact, you know, if you make a cock-up, you won't, it won't end the turn, so, so keep that in mind when we go through this.